Review. A Wizard's Choice by Maya Tyler. Description. Dreams or Duty. Wizard apprentice Curtis Ward doesn't want to become a full-fledged wizard, but he feels obligated to his grandfather who raised him. Making the choice, whether or not to become a wizard and join the circle, doesn't feel like a choice at all. Leaving the circle would give Curtis the freedom to follow his own dreams, and to pursue Vampire S. D., who has always intrigued him. He knows there's more to D than the icy being she portrays, but will she give him a chance to know the real her? There is unrest in the magical world. Fairies, a magical being thought to be long extinct, still exist. And the long-time feud between wizards and fairies threatens everyone Curtis cares about, including his life coach, Alina, who has quickly become a close friend. And perhaps more. He discovers his connection to the ancient beings the Anunnaki, the ancestors of wizards and fairies, may be key to the future. The more he uncovers, the more questions he has. Will Curtis choose to follow his heart or risk sacrificing his own happiness for peace in the magical world? My Opinion A Wizard's Choice by Maya Tyler is a paranormal story. It's the second book from the Magicals series. Curtis Ward was raised by his grandfather, Walder Ward, since he was a baby. Walder was a wizard and part of the circle. While Curtis was growing up he was taught to be a wizard as well. At one point he had to make the decision of joining the circle or not. Unfortunately, he never felt that this was his destiny. So he decided to find out about his past and his parents. His journey for knowledge started with surprises and death threats. Did Curtis make the right choice? It's such a good story. If you have read the previous book then you will recognize the first few chapters. It's where Curtis and his grandfather helped a vampire and how he met Dee. This book is divided into two parts, one is about his past and the need to find who he is. The second is his romance with the ancient vampire. Truth be told I was drawn more to the part about the fairies and the feud with the wizards. I am not a big fan of Dee and her hot and cold treatment. The way everything was revealed was very enjoyable and full of surprises. The end was a shock for me, I expected a different one. This was a very interesting read for me and I will rate it with 4.5 stars.